have you found that there are a certain number of kids who think it's good to be brutal? And are those the kids who are going to be psychopaths? And have you found amoral babies? We always find in our studies some kids do what we expect, show a moral response, show a moral understanding, and others don't. What we don't know is whether we're pulling apart different kinds of kids or whether just as in any experimental study, some kids kind of doze off or they aren't very good at responding. So none of this here is a psychopath detector. None of this is a way of telling what kids will turn out good and what kids will turn out bad. Um, we do know from other research that humans vary in their qualities. Humans vary in how compassionate they are and how helpful they are. And on one extreme edge of this variation is what we call sociopathy or psychopathy, which are individuals who just don't give a damn about anybody else. But you don't know, I'm asking, whether that's because of some life experience or whether that individual was actually born that way. As best we know, it's some combination of the two. So we know that characteristics like empathy and caring for others are heritable, which means that the variation you find in the human population is to some extent due to your genes, not your environment. We also know that certain environments can nurture compassion and others could slam it shut. 